I'd spent my career dozing off in the briefing room. Now wasn't the time. starting to feel as if I'd never leave that place. Like one of those nightmares where you keep running and running only to discover you're chasing yourself. Nothing I was gonna find in there could make a difference now. I had all the evidence I needed. This wasn't good. I needed to find a way out of that stairwell and fast. That would have been too easy. My eyes and throat burned, but at least I could breathe. I was trying to work out what direction I was headed in when I discovered some more Brazilian architecture not designed for the American physique. There it was, the tape from the Bronco security system. Jesus, it was that guy. I had seen him in the favela, Bachmeyer, Becker's right-hand man. His time would come, him and Becker. couldn't get that tape out of my head. Why had Ufe killed Rodrigo? I wasn't gonna find any answers in the forensics lab. I had to push on. Hey pal, nice to see you. Vai pra casa, gringo de merda. I don't think we've been properly introduced. I know who you are. And you should have killed me in the office when you had the chance. There's still time, meu camarada.
another pile of bodies and still nothing to show for it. I felt like I was detaching, that maybe this was revenge for something else, something buried deep in the past. It was a little late to be thinking about precautions, but something told me this shit show was barely through the warm-up act. Rodrigo, Giovanna, Passos, everyone who'd meant anything was gone. Like so many times before, I'd found myself alone, locked on a course of destruction. It was at my worst when I was at my best. I felt like I was going around in circles, getting further away from the truth. I had to find my way out of there.
Becker and Bachmeyer had taken their pound of flesh and sold it on the black market. Now I was coming for mine. Beleza, rapaziada, bom trabalho. Só tô esperando a confirmação do outro grupo, mas o gringo já deve estar tá morto agora. Senhor, ele não parece estar tá morto. Da puta, pelo amor puta. de Deus. Temos mais Love to interfere in things you do not understand. Oh, I understand plenty, asshole. How stupid can one man be? Why do you think you're not dead already? I couldn't get a direct shot. I was gonna have to get creative. It was a waste of bullets. His cover was too good. You should know when to walk away! Ah!
This was the passkey to Becker's office. I was close to the end of all this, and I could feel it. Becker! <laughs> Something funny about dying? I felt like the avenging angel. I looked like a fat, bald dude with a bad temper. You disgusting piece of shit! I know everything! Not everything, my friend. Let go of him, Max. Huh? Hmm? <laughs> There's a good fellow. Well, well, well. Victor. I was wondering when you'd reappear out of whatever slimy hole you live in. <laughs> I'd like to just say, Max, I just want to say thank you for all your hard work, for my family, and for cleaning up that horrible mess with the Crasha Preto for us. You know I'm tough on crime. I give you a bonus, but I think you just fritter it away. Becker, take his gun. Thomas, you feel the poop! They had barred the door. My only hope was to chase them down. I knew they'd be leaving town, and my guess is they would try to fly out of here. Rich people love to fly away. God damn it! <laughs> 